basically saying that's illegal or some shit like that. And it's just like, you're doing the same shit. So why are you being hypocritical? And, and also, too, um, if I can, one of his old points of contention is that he got super pissed off at us whenever we were recording. That used mm-hmm. to be one of his biggest talking points. And now look what he's doing. He's doing yeah. the same thing that he's calling other people out on. Instead of actually listening. And not only that, but at the same time, he's also recording as well. You know, he has a problem with people recording him. So, um, and I want to pull the room here. What does that make him? Hypocrite. Uh, goddamn fucking hypocrite because, you know. Yeah. If he if he had a problem recording, uh, having us record, then how come he was recording tonight? And he I think he had a problem with the recording. I think. Well, I'm just gonna say this now. I don't think he's gonna do anything without recording because, in all honesty, he's never gonna upload it to his channel. He's not gonna do jack shit. Because he because he made this threat before, mm-hmm. and nothing happened. So why yeah. should we freaking believe him now? I'm gonna well, also. Go ahead. I'm gonna point this out too. Jose was also streaming as well. Oh. On, on his channel. Was he doing it tonight? <laughs> yep. Ah. Uh, well, I even if he's okay, even if he did stream, it still didn't make any difference anyway. Mm-hmm. And well, um, because the, due to the fact of I was streaming it already. Mm-hmm. And also, too, after the stream was done, I started recording the call right after. Because, and, and that was the thing. I was having fun here, and then he just shows right on up and cries like a baby. Mm-hmm. And, of course, because, slamming- because of, Okay. Throughout that entire stream, did I say anything to him that was that could be considered, like, heinous? No. All I did was no. the, the real thing I did was I fucking called him the walking contradiction. Because that's what he does. Mm-hmm. Now you're starting to see what I think they were starting to yeah. slowly itch in. Also, I love how I join the call after Monday Night Raw is done and for the night. And suddenly I'm getting muted and called a retard because I'm not listening to him. I wasn't even looking at his fucking screen. Because I had better shit to do. And, and plus, like, not, not gonna lie, I don't know why you jumped in here, B. Hey, fucking, I honestly wanted to hear fucking the bullshit, because I knew it was gonna continue. And also, I wanna, I also wanna apologize for my outbursts, you know, I'm still and, trying to, I'm still trying to learn from that, I'll admit. Um, and, and this is what I got on I would say in your case, Nathan, not going to lie, my dude, you need to start calming down. Mm -hmm. I get it that he was pissing you off, but there is no point of getting angry with him because that's just what he wants to get out of you. Mm -hmm. And, and, And also the other part is you need to think before you say stuff like that's been the main two problems I've seen with you. Is you get triggered easily and you freaking you resort to saying stuff without thinking it through first. I mean, it's the same thing with IRL. I I can't think straight and I just freaking do. Yeah, but but you gotta realize too, instead of screaming and stuff at him only because he muted you, you could have also still acted calmly, like how I was explaining to Jose. My mom's asleep right now, but I'm being calm and actually acting calm instead of yelling because i actually care that she's sleeping and i know and it's you don't just... want to scream like if your parents are asleep or something I you don't want to scream at the top of your lungs and wake them up and them to see how this is upsetting you you gotta act calm cool and collected <laughs> like we were like me me i was laughing my ass off at him screaming I know. <laughs> I know. Uh, I, I was like sitting here, like no. What I was doing was I was playing with the dial, like a little, mm-hmm. like a little kid. I was like, "Ooh, it goes up, then it goes Ooh. down, then it goes <laughs> up, then it goes down." I'm like, I'm like, what, what, when is he gonna let me talk? Because I was like, I'm waiting. Yes, again. But okay. but at least I did get an answer to one of my questions. 
And that yeah. question was, did I ever call him a pedophile? He actually said straight up, no. Hey, um, I'm going to ask something to Jose real quick. Jose, tonight after where you were yelling and stuff, did you actually think that was okay to do so instead of actually talking civil? Or were you just trying to get all angry and shit at all of us over the fact that you didn't want to listen to what we had to say and do an RTI move? Hello? Flaky? Ashley? I you there? think... Oh, yeah, I think what's going on is Flaky, hey, Flaky doesn't know what to say now because this is all mm -hmm. impact them. I was going to say, hard. what's going on probably right now is mentally they can't really comprehend what the fuck to do. Like yeah. in their mind, they're probably thinking no matter what they do, the next move they make, it's going to be so fucking hard for them. That's probably mm -hmm. what's going on in their brain right now. Yeah, exactly. Yes, actually... Oh, go ahead. That's actually what I was thinking right now. It's just I don't even know what's okay. inside, basically, because all this shit I've been happening. I know okay. I missed some. <laughs> hmm. Um, I know. if I, know I can, it. Ashley, if I can, there's nothing wrong with admitting up to your mistake. There's nothing wrong with that. I was only trying to pretend, it, but it's just right, I guess what triggered me is just. Girl, so, uh, Pizza Pound, I still can't see what you see because all I no, go see ahead. is literally I'm what it says. I mean, camera, library. I was trying to just, the moment I guess I was upset because you were saying stuff about him, but I guess what triggered me more is, I don't know how to put this, but I guess when he just, I think he was just talking over everyone. I was trying to say my advice and then I just didn't know what to do. So, basically, both of, both of the sides are kind of just nothing. So because, uh, okay, because he's unwilling to have a public discourse with people. Because mm -hmm. his idea of talking to people is talking over them and screaming. That is, not, listening. That, that, that is not a way to have a public discourse with anyone. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, okay, say like, um, for example, I had a problem with Caroline. Okay. <laughs> I, I would bring Caroline in and I would talk to her and figure out what is going on. Mm -hmm. And if she's in the wrong, I'm going to call her in the wrong. I've done it to at least everyone in here at one yeah. point, except Caroline. I've done it to B. I've done it to Nathan. I've done it to Zeldin. I've, mm -hmm. all, I've called them all out before on stuff that they've done. Mm-hmm. I've and actually... Can, oh, go ahead. I've actually called um, Ashley out on stuff, too, when he and I were still friends because of his wrong decisions. I actually wanted him to get more help instead of just being staying on the internet and trying to get all of this stuff straightened out. Because the internet right now is not... The ideal place to be at because right now you're going through emotions but don't know which side to pick i know sally was trying to stay neutral but for her own sake she, i even saw she has been she was thinking a lot and stuff she was like it's because of like, me i over like having i do want to no, let me finish else. let me Sorry. finish let me finish see the time i was her friend friend sister and then to girlfriend because of the poly she was always thinking and stuff and i was trying to help her out and at the same time before her and i even got together in the poly i was even helping you because i actually cared about you but it got to a point where in that one video that you made about all of us you saying you're a fake trans think all of us were fake was the point of where I didn't want to come back to this or hear about your name. I was just but saying with shit. I had to let out the truth I, out of me. I know, I know, I know, I know. But 
you gotta also think about how others are gonna be affected by this personally and mentally as well and how sally personally fucking hurt me and stuff there are gonna be people too that are gonna dislike their kinks because they've dealt with pedos who like those sort of things too and they dislike it and rti is saying that i sent child porn in her own server which is a fucking lie i've only sent furry stuff yeah i don't know if i fully yeah saw i do it. that at times but what was it what was it i mean i don't remember because oh but i was gonna say i i forgot ender actually ender is a mind. i don't see how he's not able to get in here but regardless of that if Sally actually cared about all of us and what we actually thought about, like, how she hurt me, Golden, Shani, Dakota, Flame, and all those others in my, in my poly relationships, or the fact she hurt so many people as well, like Dragon Gamer. You remember <laughs> Natasha and Bolt and how they were personally affected by Anthony. You yeah, were, you I were in Artemis's. You were in Artemis's VC. You were on Ponytown when they were even talking to you about it. You were there. You saw how it personally affected all of us. And yet, this, and at this point, the, re the true reason why I made that venting video was because I couldn't have my, I didn't want to have these things bottle up because I didn't, <clears throat> it personally, it affected me to a point of where I didn't want to stop because I actually trusted you and Sally to a certain point. I do not care if Diane was involved or anything. Diane made her own choice. Diane, bring Roy. up Diane or Roy. Focus on the topic. I'm not trying to be me. I'm sorry. I just no. no, no. I'm just saying. Um. Uh, okay. Um. Ashley, you're free to speak in here. If you disagree with something someone is saying, go ahead. No, I mean I know what she's trying to say, but it's just I don't like those people. I mean they did did me dirty in the past too. It's just I don't want to think about them. Yeah, but yet you also have MLB Black Shadow in your server. Who after the? I'm not even friends with him. Wanting, then who invited him to your I server? I didn't add him to my server. I'm just trying to get people to like to help me build my server up. And you should uh, have okay. actually... Uh, you if I can here. Yeah, go ahead. Then, not trying to be a cunt to you here, Ashley, you shouldn't be building a server with those people in it. Mm -hmm. Because um, what MLP Black Shadow has done is he's ERP'd with a freaking with a freaking miner. Mm-hmm. Like, how do you say it? And this is stuff that people in the brony community have been, well, not the brony community, people outside of it are saying is the main problem is that the brony community does not want to sit down and deal with these pedophiles that are in it. They sit comfortably in this, in this, in that community and nothing is being done about them. That's why, okay, if you look, Cosmic's channel, for example, that's why Cosmic's channel mainly exists, is so that way he can speak out about these predators that are going around in freaking hunting kids. That's mm -hmm. why he's on YouTube. So I'm going to point this out too. Remember in the group chat, where I told you to block the miners that you ERP'd with. Yeah, I, I still Flurry have them blocked. And love bright. Fuck Flurry, I don't know what's well, I don't know what's new where her account is anymore because this is my new account. But point is, if you didn't want to mm. fuck up again, then why would you add them as friends even, even after what you did to them? Why would you add them? Or, here's also another thing. Why did you block Cosmic, even though he just wanted things to be settled already with you? But then, instead of staying, you ran. 
I was also over here in the server. That was I was over here in, in server by that time with RTI. He's telling me the same thing. I got triggered, so I just chose a side. Um. Also, quick question, Caroline. Mm -hmm. Is Ashley a pedophile? Yes or no? Yes. I did. Then, okay. Then I'm not trying to be a cunt, but they're like, as soon as this calls over, sorry, Ashley, I got to give you the boo. Because no, because what it would do is it would reflect horribly on me for having someone mm -hmm. that is a pedophile in my server. You're free to talk here, but I'm just yeah. letting you know right after. Mm hmm. Because mm -hmm. if you actually do want to really redeem yourself, then leave all of that dream, like leave RTI server and stuff. If you want to stay away from him, if you are still getting therapy and shit, actually um, disable your accounts till you actually feel like fucking coming back, or like Sally even, because you both are making cho bad, really bad choices. Mm -hmm. All I'm gonna say. Um also, if I can here, and I'm sorry for butting in every two seconds, but okay. <laughs> um, how many kids has Ashley done this to? Two. I'm still trying to get screenshots from Love Bright Pitch Nick. She's not actually answering. Okay. Um, what were the ages, if you don't mind me asking? Not fucking deal with those assholes. 